Welcome, welcome here on I need help at C squared. This problem we're going to reflect the triangle over y equals x. So, first of all, let's take a look to y equals x. This one. That means when um, x is 1, y is 1. When x is 2, y is 2. When x is 0, y is 0. And so on, right? So, this is the line of reflection. Okay, a line that cut quadrant 1 and 2 in half, bisect is a fancy word, right? This is the line of reflection. And we need to reflect that triangle over uh, this line. But let's start with this point C, which is negative 2 and 3. So 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. This is the point C. Right, negative 2 and 3. How are we going to do that reflection? And this is a little bit tricky, but if you go, if you go slow, then you're not know going to be slow. Let me what I'm doing. I'm, I'm kind of count. I'm going to say one segment. That is the diagonal. That's more small uh, uh, square. Another segment. And a half of that. I'm going to do the same thing. Half, one, and one. This is the guy. This is C prime. Okay, so what are the coordinates? So we look into this guy here, we notice is 3 and negative 2. So let's put that here on, on the screen. So we start with C, which was negative 2 and 3, and we reflect it, and we end up with C prime, which is 3 and negative 2. And let's try to write the rule now. X, Y, right? So instead of negative 2 and 3, I'm going to put x, y. What's happened here? If we notice, uh, this y becomes the x. So we're going to have y here, right? And this x becomes the y. So y, x. So yes, yes, whenever you reflect over y equals x, x and y switch interchange if you want to call it like that. Okay, so basically now we can do the other points. Let's start to A, A, which is negative 7 and 2, right? That will become what? A prime will become what? Okay, x and y switch, so it's going to be 2 and negative 7. What about point B? Point B, which uh, was negative 4 and 6, will be what? B prime, and we switch again, 6 and negative 4. And if you want to plot those guys, you can get a nice picture. So that is the rule that you may want to remember when you do a reflection over y equals x. If you do not remember, do one point, get the rule, and move on. If you enjoy and you learn in this video, if any helps you, don't forget to click the like button, then right, and come back and see Square for more help.